Hey, how y'all doing this evening? This evening I'm going to be cooking on the salt block again. I'm going to put it on the Traeger. It's going to be really good, y'all. I'm going to do some fresh seafood here. I've got some fresh Gulf shrimp here that I got from uh, Long Beach Seafood a little bit earlier. I've also got some wonderful diver scallops. Y'all check these out. Big, beautiful scallops here. So what we're going to do is put all my seafood over here in a bowl, put it right here. My scouts, my shrimp, everything else like that. Now I've got some of this, uh, look at this little jerk sauce here from Pirate Johnny's, sweet jerk hot sauce. Ooh, it's not really that hot, I taste this. It's got a good flavor to it. I think this will be good to flavor this stuff with. Just put a little bit on here, I mix it around. Use some of that. Put a link to where you can get that. And also this Bezels, I always put a link to this. Great Cajun seasoning, y'all. It's my favorite by far. Sprinkle that on there. Put the olive oil. You know, just a little lubrication there. And we'll just kind of mix all that around. With the Cajun seasoning, the olive oil, and the uh, Pirate Johnny's little jerk seasoning. And I'll just let this kind of marinate somewhat while we heat up the Traeger out there. I've got my Traeger on over here. I was letting it preheat. Got my salt block on here that I preheated in the oven about 350 degrees. I'm going to go ahead and turn my Traeger up to high. Close this dude up and we will let it preheat. As far as wood, um, I mean pellets go, I'm just using a blend. It's one of the cheaper, I'm not using my good Traeger pellets because at this high heat, you're not really getting much smoke. So I just wanted to use something just to, you know, it's 100% hardwood blend just to get that heat up there. Using, like I said, I'm using my grill too. I'll put a link to that and also uh, a little salt block back there. Hey y'all, while I'm doing this video here while the grill's heating up and everything, I want to give a shout out to a viewer that is actually, uh, didn't really request me to do this recipe, but they're doing it as well tonight. They're asking for some advice. Robert Navarro, uh, man, this one's for you, dude. Um, go ahead and do this. Hope yours turn out great tonight as well. So uh, we're going to let the grill heat up. We're at about 190 now. We'll go ahead. I want this thing about 500 degrees before we put the shrimp and the scallops on, y'all. Y'all, my grill Traeger's come up to 10. I've got the wonderful scallops and shrimp here kind of pour a little cookie cooling rack to dry them off a little bit. We're going to go ahead and put them on, y'all. This is going to be real, real nice here. we get you turned where you can see everything. That should be about good right there. Shut the door here. We're gonna let it go about three minutes on that side, y'all. We're gonna give them a flip. But y'all, it's been about three minutes, so we're gonna go ahead and give them a flip now. They should be sure about where they need to be. Oh wow, look at that! Doors. Flip it there. Flip it Look at that, y'all. I'm going to cover this pole with my grill. 
kind of wipe up some of this excess moisture. We'll put the next round there and kind of help a little bit. You don't want too much moisture because you transfer a bunch of salt. So now I'm going to go ahead and put some shrimp on here. Get these shrimp cooking. These are going to be wonderful too, y'all. Y'all, it's been a couple minutes. I'm going to go ahead and flip these shrimp because they don't take long. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That looks so good. I mean, that, that's such a custom cooking and spines right there, Also cooking some too here just on the grill, not on the block. Go ahead and flip these. This is shrimp I know. Ready to flip. Let's go ahead and serve some of these wonderful scallops and shrimp up here. I've got some yellow rice we're going to serve it with. I think that'll be a great little addition here. A towel here to clean up what little mess I got around here. All right, y'all. Now I'm going to take a little bit of a smoked uh, paprika, kind of garnish it with that. I think that'll go very well with this scallops and shrimp. Whoop much there. It's going to be really, really good, y'all. Wonderful. Wonderful, y'all. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. Get that scallop right there. Yes, sir. This is looking good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Wonderful flavor. Wonderful flavor. Okay. That was really, really good. Perfect flavor add. A little bit of that Himalayan salt right there with the scallop. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm -mm. I try one the shrimp now. Perfect. Outstanding. You got a little of that jerk flavor from that one too with that um, Pirate Johnny's jerk season. Really, really good, y'all. I'm gonna put all those links in the description box you know, with that stuff. You gotta try this salt block seafood right here on the Traeger, y'all. 